Read data. Check, save, save the data to SD card. Step 2, write data to the new brand screen. Buckle the new brand screen. Burn data. Or click, open. Select the corresponding file for burning. Step 3, installation. Install the screen to the phone. Boot view. True tone recovered. Connect the 12 to 13 Truly Tone Repair Module with the Type-C data cable to the computer. Open JC Repair Assistant, click Repair Fitting, and click Connect. Step 1, read the original screen data. Attach the original screen to the corresponding port of the module. Click Read. You can also click Save, save the file locally. Step 2, write data to the new brand screen. Buckle the new brand screen. Click, write, or click, open, to write the local file. Wait until the screen displays, burning succeeded. Online operation completed. The original screen of this 12 Pro Max is damaged. It can no longer display normally. Let's replace a new original screen. Remove the original screen. Step 1, read the original screen data. Power on Pro 1000S. Switch to original screen mode. Buckle the original screen. Read screen data. Step 2, write the original screen data to the new original screen. Buckle the new original screen. Write data. Step 3. Move the Touch IC of the original screen to the new original screen. Install the Touch IC of the original screen to the new original screen. Step 4. Install the new screen to check whether the true tone is restored. Install the new original screen to the phone. Power on. True tone is displayed normally. Operation completed. Online operation is the same for repair with an original screen or brand screen. After the online reading and writing completed, the Touch IC of the original screen needs to be moved to the new original screen, which could help to avoid the pop-up prompt of non-original screen, and then install the new screen for check. Connect the phone to the computer with a data cable. Open JC Repair Assistant. Open the Read Phone interface. Click Trust on the mobile phone. The platform automatically queries the screen SN and MTSN data of the mobile phone. Attention! For iPhone 8 to 11 models, the screen SN and MTSN can be obtained from the mainboard NAN by connecting the phone to JC Repair Assistant or other platforms, and the true tone can be restored by writing the code to the screen via JC device. For iPhone 11P to 13PM models, the screen SN and MTSN cannot be obtained directly from the mainboard NAND if the phone has been connected to JC, Repair Assistant or other platforms before when it still has its original screen and its original screen SN and MTSN has been backed up to platform before. Then could write the backup data on platform to the new screen to restore the true e tone. Otherwise, no able to restore with this method.
connect the jailbroken phone to JC Repair Assistant. Enter the Read Phone interface. Unbind, then you could obtain the screen SN and MTSN. Four phones cannot jailbreak. Disassemble the NAND. Put on P13 NAND socket. Connect to JC Repair Assistant. Click iPhone fitting unbind. Unbinding takes 5 to 20 minutes. After unbinding completed, install the NAND to the main board. Install the main board to the phone. Boot the phone and connect it to the repair fitting interface on JC Repair Assistant. Then you can obtain the screen SN and MTSN. Question 1. The touch IC of the original screen has been moved to the new screen. What if the data of the original screen cannot be read out? Resolvent. Connect the new screen to the 12 to 13 series screen read write module. Read the new screen data through the JCID platform. Copy and write the cover code of the touch IC to display cover code. Question 2. Why does it pop up when the original touch IC has been moved? Cause. The screen SN has been changed by mistake. Resolvent. Connect the phone to the JC Repair Assistant. Click Trust on your phone. Obtain the screen SN data of the phone. Copy data. Connect the new original screen to the 12 to 13 series screen read write module. Enter the Repair Fitting interface. Read data.